Hello, and welcome to, In the No Philippines, and my name is Odessa. And if you're new to this channel, please don't forget to subscribe. The F-A-50 is a new light combat aircraft, manufactured by Korea Aerospace Industries, for the Republic of the Philippines. The F-A-50, which is based on the T-50 supersonic advanced trainer platform, is offered as an affordable and efficient supersonic advanced light attack platform. The combat aircraft is intended to meet the light fighter requirements of air forces around the world. The advanced radar provides the F-A-50 with detection capability, which is similar to that of the KF-16 fighter. The F-A-50 measures 13.14 meters in length, 9.45 meters in width, and 4.82 meters in height. The empty weight of the aircraft is 6.47 tons. The aircraft can take off with a maximum gross weight of 12.3 tons. The tandem glass cockpit of the F-A-50 can carry two crew members. It is equipped with wide field of view head-up display, color multifunction displays, digital engine instrumentation, hands-on throttle and stick, integrated up-front controls and zero-zero ejection seat. One thing I've noticed, the Philippine military could have done a better job at marketing its purchases, or shall I say, presenting them to the Filipino nation. At this point, in the Philippine military's modernization program, there are still a lot of Filipinos who do not believe that they own or have recently acquired advanced military assets, which is sad. Many do not even know that the Philippine Air Force already has a squadron of F-A-50s. These people end up diminishing the Philippine military by not believing in the military's capacity or determination to improve, which is an insult. And since it is the military's goal to protect the nation, they must have the nation's trust and support for them to perform at their best in all ways. And it should be the military's duty to at least spread the word to every Filipino about every undertaking they overcome or achieve, to erase doubts, and to make every Filipino proud. And trust the nation's military capabilities. Well, that is just my opinion. Why do you guys think many are still unaware of these acquisitions? Comment down below. And if you like this video, please do not forget to like, share and subscribe. And tap or click on the notifications icon so you won't miss any updates. We will continue to give you more updates about the Philippine military. Once again, my name is Odessa. Thank you and thanks for watching.